I had a. I, re I responded to Cindy Crawford on ya on Yahoo question and answer thing that they have. It's this new function where someone can post a question and then a bunch of people can respond to answers to it. And her question was about ca cancer and how to how to cure cancer. What we can do as a world to cure cancer. And I and I had a response and I responded that. I think cancer is like a lot of things, a lot of problems in our in our world. One of which would be like global warming. I think that's kind of a a problem that this world faces. It's on par with it, and I don't think we're going to be taking care of that anytime soon. I just don't think we are. But I think I know why. I think it's because we don't speak the same language. I think it's because the world does not have any way of communicating. There's, we're not going to be able to overcome this conflict, this ridiculous conflict, if we don't speak the same language. We have to learn it. We have to learn something, or at least... Well, then I put, like, in my message, English is the most commonly spoken language in the world. And my friend Kiff, came, who I, I read it to before, while I was editing it, like before I put it up, he said he didn't like it because it wasn't true. Chinese is the most commonly spoken language. So I went online and I looked, and Chinese is the most commonly spoken language. It's like 1.2 billion people, and English is like 500 million. I think that's about right. And it's understandable because there's a lot of people in China. 3 billion, or a bit, 1 billion, I think. And there's 3 billion in the world. I think that's what it is. So Chinese is it's a lot of people. So I think that, that I, I, we need to institute some sort of language program in the U.S. school. It has to be done. Like really a real institution. There has to be a globalization of language. In the, we have to spread. God, you know, I, and I thought, why not pay English teachers salaries like you, play so, like you pay soldiers? It's not unheard of. It's, it's, it's an important job to send people over there and to teach English. And it's an important job to institute Chinese language classes in our schools. It's important to learn these languages so that maybe in 20 years we can overcome the conflict because our sons and their daughters can finally communicate without a translator. The translator is what causes the war. It's like we're pretending like we're communicating and we're not. We're not. You cannot. It's like sending a message in text. It, it doesn't communicate. And there's no way to overcome conflict. People don't understand this is the only thing to do right now. It's the most important thing that we have to do right now is to learn one language that we can start building a base of trust with. And it's not as hard as it seems. It's just a matter of someone rallying the troops and saying it has to be done. And this is how to do it. And I'm going to do it. Fuck it. Who? You, why not? Why not me? Why not you? I want to do it. If you're interested in it, let me know. If this is something that, that's, that really, you know, sparks something in you. If you're into language. If you think it's as important as I do, let me know. Please let me know. There has to be some sort of dialogue about this, and I'm more than happy to start talking about it, so let's go from here.